Hello, I invite you to compare chain checkers made by ProX, Bikehand, B-Tool and ParkTool. The first ProX RCD33 is the only one that is painted and in my opinion it's a minus. Another with downside is only one marking and you don't know what degree of wear it determines. Next tool is YC503, also branded by ProX, but as you can see it's a bike hand whose products have some flaws and are sometimes made of poor quality materials, but they make up for it with their prices and capabilities. I have already compared bike hand wheel through wing stand in another video, to which link you will find in the upper right corner and in the description. 503 is well made, has two wear marks, 0.75% and 1, is cheap and easy to use. The third one is Beetle H001, which has the same scale as bike hand. Mine checker is 7 years old and it's a reason why I made this test. Lastly, it began to show that all my chains are stretched. That is why I contacted the manufacturer, who told me that chain checkers could also wear out, which I didn't know before, so that's also a tip for you. The last part tool CC3.2 is the longest and several times more expensive than the previous checkers, but you know, it's not a cheap company. What's most important for me, as the only one has indication of 0.5% wear, which is necessary for 12-speed chains. All of them have the same thickness of 2mm, weighs from 33 to 45 grams, and apart from B2, the indications were the same. I checked 10, 11 and 12-speed chains, which were new and used with a mileage up to 800 km. To sum up this test, in my opinion it looks like this. The first Pro X cost about 3 euro and I definitely do not recommend it. It has only one marking and it's painted. Number 2 and 3, so bike hand Pro X, you can also get for 3 euro and that's a very good choice. It has two values, is precisely made and easy to use. Next Beetle worked fine for many years, it cost less than 4 euro and now there is a newer, longer version for 12-speed chains, H011. The last spark tool you can buy for about 12 euro and it's my leader, as the only one can measure 12-speed chains because it has 0.5% marking and at this value it's recommended to change the chain in such drivetrains. In addition, it's the longest, so it should be the most precise. And I hope that like other Park Tool stuff, it's made of a good quality steel, so it will last a really long time. And will a bike can't last as long? Only time will tell. In my opinion, saving money on chain checkers is not a good idea, because it's the only part that guarantees swapping the chain on time, which can significantly extend the life of your drivetrain. Personally, I also would not recommend to buy the cheapest models of chains, but choose the higher version, which works better and are more durable, so in the end, they come out cheaper. Thanks for watching, if you have any questions, feel free to write in the comments, and if you like the video, drop a like and subscribe my channel, where I publish new movies every Monday and Thursday. See ya!